How's it going guys? Welcome back to Cocktail Hammer. My name is Jedi. So today I'm going to talk about a couple of cocktail shakers. I'm just going to do a very quick review of one that I liked at the beginning but didn't like so much later. So one of which is this guy right here. So this is the the Snow Fox Cocktail Shaker. So this guy right here looks amazing when you search for it on Amazon. It looks great, it honestly does. And it has a pretty nice logo there. It's insulated mostly. And um, we'll talk about that in just a second. Well, first we'll talk about the good. <laughs> the color is beautiful, it looks great. You know, it's a cobbler shaker, so you can pull up the top. You don't need another strainer. You don't, you don't need multiple strainers to work with this. I mean, unless you're using something with egg, you know, you're gonna want a fine mesh strainer. Um, it also has this, uh, what is this called? It also has this gasket around the top so that it can prevent things from like lodging in. Um, it does a pretty good job. However, it comes off pretty easily, which is a problem because if you try to use it without it, this is what happens, you know? So you need this and if this breaks, you're on your own. Um, and it also needs to be put on in a very specific way because there's grooves along the shaker that demand that it needs to be in the right direction. So anyway, so that's all fine and dandy. You know, it, it's insulated, so when you shake it up, it's not gonna get freezing in your hands, and that's good also. However, there's a couple of problems with the shaker. One, it's not completely insulated, so while you're shaking it, the top is gonna get very cold, but you know, the body is gonna be fine. Like the, the payload, I guess you can call it. It's gonna be fine, it's not gonna make your fingers frozen or anything. The biggest problem with the shaker, however, is that the top will not come off. I don't know what I did, I didn't think I did anything. I mean, I have another shaker right here. This is a super cheap shaker that I got from Amazon and also, the top won't come off. So the only way to use the shaker is just like a Boston shaker. So you might as well just buy a Boston shaker in the first place because most likely this is gonna happen. And same thing happened with this. So if you're in the market for a cocktail shaker, consider just going ahead and getting a Boston shaker because if you get a cobbler, the odds of this happening to you are very high. All right, so back to the Snow Fox shaker. Um, I don't love it. I'm not gonna get it again. And if you're considering getting this one, I'd say go for a different one. You can check out cocktailhammer.com. So that's all I got for now, guys. If you like this video, consider hitting the like button and consider subscribing. It really helps out the channel. So thanks so much and I'll see you next time.